All right. Thanks, Stephanie. All right. So um, this is uh, the opportunity to share the different partners with our church. And so this year is Malawi and then also a relatively new partner. Well, it is a new partner is working with some organizations at the border between Juarez and El Paso. And so um, when we talk about where we're working down there, we try not to use the word border because that can be very um, divisive for some people. So we really just kind of use the words of migrants is what we talk about is we're just trying to support migrants with basic needs. Um, so uh, we do have volunteers at scheduled at every location. Um, I also have a staff person that is scheduled to be at every location. So if you have questions and that will come in the email that's coming your way. Um, the only one I don't have staff for is Blue Springs and Bill Elwood says he's got it. He's all over it. So I think we'll be okay. But I will send out the email with those details. So if you guys have questions, let me know. Um, so this year we have, uh, and uh, Jen held them up briefly, but we're doing dignity kits for a bara. Basically they're hygiene kits. Um, a bar really prefers that we use the word dignity kits. It's hygiene items. I just, a lot of people won't know what a dignity kit is. So I just keep saying hygiene. It's really start helping stock their warehouse that will supply shelters on both sides of the border. So in Juarez and El Paso, and it will be, you know, soap, toothbrushes, just basic necessities, diapers, things like that, that people tend to go through. So um, they can donate, it says $20, they can donate whatever they want. Um, there's a QR code on here that you can help them use to, to pull it up on their phone. If uh, they don't wanna do it then, obviously they can take the cards with them. These are at all the locations. They have little holes in them with little hooks. And so um, you can put them on the Christmas tree that's there if you run out of time. So basically I've loaded up the Christmas tree at Leewood. Um, I'm hoping the staff at different locations can load up the Christmas tree. But if you could just swing by the table before you go into worship and make sure they're on the Christmas tree, that's great. Um, and then just come out during the prayer after worship and you can just stand there, answer questions, that type of thing. Um, so that's Abara kits for migrants, hygiene kits. Any questions on that? Okay. The other one is uh, Bibles for Malawi. And this one is uh, basically a $12 donation. Once again, they can give whatever they want. We'll purchase however many Bibles we can purchase with it. Um, Bibles are in Chichewa, which is the, the language in Malawi. They actually cost $15 a person, but the Malawi Methodist Church wants people to have some skin in the game for it. So the family will give pay $3 for it. And then our donation will cover the other $12 so that they can get a Bible. Any questions on that? Okay. Uh, Sheree, cool. There is not a tree at Wesley, just FYI. Okay. I will be there. Not a problem. Okay. Thank you. Um, Sheree, is that's... there different cards for each one? So there's a card for migrants and a card for the Bibles. Yes. So the, the Abara, the migrant card is actually a really dark green. It's hard to tell. And the Malawi card is a really dark blue. And they are both of them at each location. If for and some they're slightly reason, different sizes too, aren't they? They, oh, they no, are exactly not. the same size, but they look differently. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and they can either pay right there or they can take them with, with yep. them. Is that correct? Yep. And if for some reason you've had such an influx of people yeah. wanting to donate, they can also go to core.org slash next. And it will be there. It's not there yet, but I've been assured it will be there by the weekend. Um, I've also been assured it will be announced in worship and it will be on the loop slides. So we should have plenty of advertisement that's out there. And people are kind of used to knowing to go where the joy tables are located. So that should be the same in every location. And I are think you... I, oh, sorry. No, go ahead, Stephanie. I think I know the answer to this question, but I'm just going to ask it because it might come up because I know people that I normally talk to um, on Saturday nights. But um, for the hygiene kits, there is not an option for them to provide those op items. It is just money, correct? That is correct. We're going to. And I'm assuming that's because of shipping costs and other getting the items that they can get them sourced locally or or. Yes. somewhere closer to them. 
Yes. Perfect. I mean, unless they want to drive them in their car down there. <laughs> We're just going to donate money. And Stephanie, speaking of staff members, I don't, Josh, C Josh Seifert's going to be at downtown, but just in the morning, I don't have a staff member Saturday night at downtown. I'm good. It's all good. I'm info desk missions and the advent lighter. So I'm, I'm just going to do all the things. I almost said I would do announcements too, and then it would just be a full circle. So I feel like you fine. should. It'll be fine. <laughs> I'm going to get Sunday off at Brookside if Stephanie does announcements. <laughs> <laughs> might be as entertaining as Kelly. Oh, it's hey, Saturday night. You can go, Jen. Oh, that's right. Oh, I am going Saturday night because John's missing worship on Sunday. <laughs> Make sure to heckle her. Uh -huh. So, so Cherie, Jean, Jean and I have a question. Is there going to be a Bible in Chichewa that we can look at? No, I have. I, I <laughs> No, sorry. I don't have a Bible in Chichewa. I don't think I do. I might. I'm going to have to look now. Quick, it was quick. just a fun question. I've never seen one. We, you know, we were in Malawi together and, and we heard about this, so it's great, <laughs> but um, never seen a, one. There's a picture online, um, in the joy website. So you can see one. Awesome. So when you say this will be spoken into during this sermon, like, is this spoken into in the recorded sermon? No, it should be at the end towards like the announcements that they do. Okay. At the end. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. And then I would, the same thing would apply as what Kristen was saying in the Wesley. Uh, we, we are not utilizing the trees because of where they are arranged, but we have baskets and then we have our ushers um, handing them out to people as they. That's leave. perfect. Cool. Perfect. Yeah. And just make sure um, you're, and just make sure you guys come out during the prayer so that you're out there as, you know, people get up and leave. Any other questions? I got to go. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Bye-bye. I think, I think we're good then. So thank you everyone for serving. Thank you for jumping on this call real quick. And I will send a follow-up email. Awesome. All right. Thanks. See you guys later. Bye-bye.